Well, everyone is happy here at Old Trafford for the time being. I say that because the sun is shining brightly. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined for expert analysis by Stuart Robson. And we have more live action from the pre-season second group stage. It's Southampton up against Besiktas. Well, Derek, after that first game... Oh, really good header. Really fine goalkeeping. Well, so close to seeing an early goal here. It's a great save, you have to say. Takes it on. Well, hit with power and almost the right precision. Well, he always has to be regarded as a dangerous opponent, so what should we expect to see from him in this game, Stuart? Well, if they get any free kicks around the edge of the penalty area today, Derek, he is so good. And the shot just over the top. Firing it towards goal. The routine save. No mistake from the keeper. Will it be punished? And the flag is up. Offside. Well, that's just a lack of awareness. He was clearly in an offside position. Well, it's a really poor challenge. Now, what's the referee going to do about it? So we have an early booking here to report, Stuart. Yeah, and I think the referee's absolutely right. He's just making it clear to all the players out there he's not going to take any messing about here. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. Jetson for Nansch on attacking possibilities. Can he open the door to a potential goal? Really important piece of last ditch defending. Now, can they counter clinically? No possibilities in the center. Effective challenge. So, a corner here. Armstrong. And space for them here on the flank. Cuts it back. And it's still on for him. And that is how to tackle inside your own penalty area. Well, the fans are going mad here. They think that was a penalty. An effective ball in a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Can he put them ahead? Thwarting him. 
Can they cover up? Oh, fantastic effort. He made great contact, but the keeper more than equal to it. Counter attacking, very much an option. Well, you have to think they're going to take the lead at some point because they're really looking dangerous at the moment. And the referee says. Penalty. Well, that's not at all what they wanted. He's off, Stuart. Well, this could be the defining moment in the game. And the penalty is converted. I don't think anyone really questioned him. Underway again, and Southampton with the advantage here. Well, that is how to run at defenders. And options in the centre. Well, it's been difficult for Southampton to get too much of the ball, but what they've done with it has been really good, and they'll be happy with the way the game is being played. Oh, they might score here, Stuart. And there it is, the equaliser. Down to ten men, but showing guts and determination. Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top-class player. Business once more on the back of that very important equaliser. 1 1. Excellent defending. Intelligent threaded pass here. Well, not hard to read that pass. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Will they profit from this situation? Oh, he really bruised the crossbar. Well, he made great contact with that one, but the goalkeeper had his own ideas. Trying to deliver it accurately. Making sure nothing came of it. Has a go. Well, the keeper has outdone himself. Wonderful save. They favoured a short one here. The inside route looking promising. Despite their numerical disadvantage, they find themselves in front. Well, just watch this again. A change of pace, a change of direction, and a decent finish. That's a very good goal. And the ball is moving again. Anyone's guess how this is going to finish? 2-1 currently. Ward Prowse. Jay Adams. And that will do it for the first half.
plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Bednarek. Armstrong. And he's beaten him here. Can he finish this? Terrific save. Well, that's a top-class save. He read it so well. Over it comes. Well, not great on the accuracy front. Goal kick here. Well, Anderson Talisca had plenty to say for himself in the first 45. Sum up his performance for us. Yes, he's played well, hasn't he? Obviously took his goal well, but his overall performance... Oh, really good reflexes and danger averted. Trying to pick out a teammate. Able to get a body in the way. Thumps clear. A switching play and needed to be spot on, but it wasn't. Armstrong. Diallo. The ball with James Ward-Prowse. Just cutting off the supply. This could be the equaliser. But oh, what a... Important save. How about that? Well, at least he hit the target, but he should really beat the keeper from there. They should be level now. And it is substitution time at this juncture. Not just from one side, but from both. Well, the danger is still there. Threat over for now, it seems. Cenk Tosun. Stuart Armstrong. The ball with James Ward Prowse. Chance to do damage. Will they get themselves level here? And a goal. It was served up on a silver platter for him. They've really got to give credit to the entire team because this was a bit like climbing Mount Everest. Well, he's outplayed and outfought him. To jump in front. And a goal! Well, against all the odds, they hit the front. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. Can't really say defences are on top. Three, two. Ward Prowse. Into the final 20 minutes. And there's the feed into the box. But goalkeeper's ball, disappointingly for them. Deli Alley. 
Extremely sloppy in possession. Ward Prowse. Armstrong. Well, that's a foul, and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position. Touched onto the woodwork. Can they put it away? Oh, a goal! And every player's worst nightmare, because this will go down as an own goal. Well, as you can see, it came off him last, and as a result, it will be an own goal. So unfortunate. Well, what an extraordinary scoreline. Does this game have more goals in it? Che Adams. Just ten minutes to go. Can they grab the lead late on? And that's destined to run all the way through to the keeper. And into the clutches of the goalkeeper. Cenk Chosun. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Opportunity. Oh, goal! Astonishing late drama. The ten men find themselves in front. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Bednarek. Can they fashion something? They need a goal. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Oh, in with a chance! Promising attack, but his timing was off. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Teixeira. Well, three minutes of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. could be the equaliser and the ball is loose and lining it up oh what a great save to keep them in front well he's just about won them the game here great stop over it comes well not cleared away completely this could level it pivotal moment defensively and there it is the full time whistle here and it's a victory for the visitors Yes, Derek. Well, it could have gone either way, couldn't it? It was so competitive for much of the game, but they kept pushing, kept believing, and probably deserved the winner in the end. A great result. Well, at times, I must say, Anderson Taliska made it look rather... Something dark that I like, but I can't quite put my pinky on it. Got a good appetite for a bad reputation. But I don't want to be just another one of your six feet deep, like.
finally made some time for me. I'm happy, I'm calm, I'm jiggy, I'm sweet, I'm chasing my dreams, you're aggy. And here we are at one of the great venues for football anywhere in the world, Old Trafford in Manchester. I'm Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and alongside me at the microphone is Stuart Robson. And we have pre-season action to bring you with the final group stage game moments away. It is Besiktas up against Newcastle United. Well, both these teams will be looking for a strong finish to the group stages here today in what has been a really good tournament so far. Certainly the quality of the football has been excellent. Just hope that's the case again today. So the starting 11 for Newcastle United. Alan Sam Maxima plays with Ryan Fraser in the wide areas. And the striker is a player with considerable know how, Callum Wilson. Well, it is without question a very special day. This is his debut match. Stuart, what should we expect to see from him? Well, first and foremost, he's a good defender. He reads danger, he wins his aerial duels, and he organizes those around him. He can also come out with the ball. He just needs a good start here. And that's a corner. Struggling to get it away. And fine goalkeeping. Abubakar. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Can he put them ahead? Magnificently. Trippier. And snuffing out the danger. Abubakar. He's in with a chance. Oh, marvellous goalkeeping. Well, it's a top class save from a top class goalkeeper. That's absolutely brilliant. Straight forward for the keeper. Wilson options in the middle cuts it back and how well the keeper did well that's just exceptional he reacted so quickly there played over by Fraser here well it still could be dangerous Newcastle come away with it Dan Byrne. Trippier now. An awful lot of green space to run into. But they dealt with the threat first. Anderson Taliska. Poor pass under no real pressure. Sam Axima. Committed challenge. And Newcastle showing good width. And reading it absolutely superbly. Intense pressure. A room to roam on the wing. Will this corner bear fruit for them? Played over by Fraser here. Well, sometimes they come off for you. Sometimes they don't, Stuart. Well, he didn't get the technique right there. And as a result, he mistimes the contact on the ball. Jetson Fernandes. And out of play. The pass nearly worked out, but not quite. Sam Aximan. Callum Wilson. How could he take them on and beat them? Well, the keeper has outdone himself. Wonderful save. 
Jetson Fernandes. Valentin Rosier. Well, it looked so promising, but a goal kicked the outcome. Callum Wilson. On to Fraser. Joe Willock. It's with Isaac Hayden. Good looking ball. On to Wilson. Well, what an opportunity that was. Well, that's a great chance to open the scoring. It's a poor effort in the end. And that will do it for the first half. the second half commences both sides can reflect on a first half in which they were so very evenly matched cuts in from the flank will he finish capable of so much better from that position no oh, mistake by the keeper well making amends is all part of the game well no wonder he looks relieved that could have proved costly. Well, many have wondered if they would get it over the line in terms of the deal. They've succeeded, Stuart. Well, he'll certainly bring a lot of know-how to this team. And, of course, quality. I think he's still... Oh, wait a minute, Stuart. Opportunity. And the keeper flings himself. at the ball well they have been getting three substitutes warmed up and by the look of it all three are coming on Saint-Maxima on to Fraser Saint-Maxima can he put them in front substitution for Newcastle United coming off the pitch Number 14, Isaac Hayden. Coming they do like the to pitch. press whenever they can. Anderson Tadiska takes the shot. And a goal! Now they have their opener. And now they can celebrate. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. ball moving again what sort of response will we see from them now and into the last 30 minutes now Joel Linton Willock Newcastle moving the ball forward what can they do from here Defender doing his job. Oh, he's given it away inexplicably. And it's a goal. Level again. What a match this is you turning out to be. Nine, Back underway. Level pegging. One goal apiece in this game. Now, will they be able to play it in behind the defence? As clean as a whistle, that challenge. And Jenk Chosun. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Now, brilliant work to keep that one in play. 
Callum Wilson. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? They really look after the ball when they have it. Well, they couldn't keep that sequence going, unfortunately. Cenk Chosu. And the attack looks promising. Teammates in the middle. No nonsense clearance. Just 15 minutes remaining. And a chance for him on the flank. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Can he take the chance? And not cleared away properly. Well, as you can see, that's the perfect half volley. He makes such good contact with the ball. It's an excellent goal. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Substitution for Newcastle United, coming off the pitch, 21. Burn. Ryan Fraser, coming onto the pitch, number 20. Davidson Sanchez. Joe Linton. It's Jamal Lewis. They get forward, but time is very much against them here. Oh, what an opportunity. High-quality goalkeeping, and still they lead. Well, that's a great save. That could be the match-winning stop there. And a substitution in the offing. And the keeper able to hold on to it. Gezal. Now, what can they produce on the flank? And it might be. Well, and he read it really well. Fine save. Not the pass he had in mind. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Well, so many possibilities, but it didn't happen for them. Good. Saint-Maximin. This could square the game. And Chris Wood. Joel Linton. The referee blows for full time. It ends at a victory for the home team. No complaints from the fans here. Yes, Derek, there wasn't much in it, to be honest. Really competitive game with chances at both ends, but they probably just about edged it overall and deserved the result in the end.
one.